corpse wax, grave wax. Let's talk about what this is. We're looking at this kind of whitey substance that's going across the sky. So there are actually loads of different forms of mummification. There's mummification that we as um, humans do, like the stuff that the ancient Egyptians do. And then there's natural processes. And here we're talking about like bog bodies and, you know, freezing cold and things like that. So we're going to be talking about all the weird and wonderful ways that a person can be mummified. Now, this is a type of mummification called saponification or adipocher. Now, basically what's happening is as the body decomposes, all of the fat that's in the body in the right conditions, so an oxygen starved environment with a specific bacteria that usually lives in the um, tummy and the moistness, and it only needs to be moistness of, the own, of your own human body, can create the perfect conditions to create this wax-like substance. And all this is, is basically a breakdown of your own fat. Now, this guy is called the Soap Man, and he was discovered in the 19th century in Philadelphia with another mummy. And what we think happened is that groundwater seeped into their caskets. And what happens is that this waxy substance forms a shell around the body. And so it never decomposes. So this is what saponification is. And we are going to be talking about all of the different kinds of mummifications. So make sure you'd comment, like, and subscribe.